See me, sir? Yes. How's the job going? Very good, Dave, very good. We've come up with a brand new scheme to eradicate homelessness in the UK. Instead of calling them homeless, we are changing it to home more. You see, as the whole country is their home... What did you want to see me for, sir? Yes, of course. We need to stop the COVID-19 virus spreading in universities. Excellent plan, sir. So, the plan is, you're going to be the COVID officer. You'll be cleaning up after the people. Or well, why not another lockdown? That seemed to do the trick. No, no, Dave. Stick to the brief. We have it under control. But the infection rates will never come down. I'm the Prime Minister of the goddamn United Kingdom and I can do what I like. Now, I swear to God, if there's even one case of coronavirus in that university, you're fucked. Hi, I'm Charlie, you can call me Dave, and I'm the University of Southampton's Coronavirus Safety Officer. It is my sole duty and responsibility to keep this virus at of this campus. Now, how do I do this? Who knows, I'm just talented. But before we begin each day, it is important to let the virus know that it is not welcome on this campus. You're not welcome! So I used to be in the SAS, where I developed an elite military skill set. I then developed SARS, which is an acute respiratory syndrome, which put me out for many years. So I'm acting as COVID officer to retrain and gain more military skill set. But I'm also here to teach. Oh, uh, I didn't realise I'd be cameras. Did I just, yeah. Um, I'm John. Uh, I don't know what to say, really. I signed up because I needed some experience on my CV. Uh, my mum thought it'd be good for me to have some responsibility. I've heard the teacher used to be a part of the SAS or something, but some people are saying he's got a few screws loose. So I've got face mask, backup face mask for the afternoon. I got hand wipes. I got sanitising gel. Morning. Morning, mate. I've got heat. Where the fuck is your mask? If I catch you, I'll forget. I'm yes. coming down your fucking throat. Am I clear? Yes. Am I clear? Yes. Am I clear? Yes. Well, the first lesson was, uh, well, it's over. Uh, that's what my thoughts on it are. I did learn something though. Uh, I learned our motto is we strive for and live by wealth and peace, which is quite nice. Although it, it, it does have an unfortunate acronym, which is that we strive for and live by WAP. Yes, thanks John. We've got to understand this virus is fast, but we are faster. Training and repetition is essential, but what is also essential is strategically placed marketing in the form of video advertisement. Let me explain. Picture this cyclist as the coronavirus. Look at it, just cycling about without a care in the world, touching things, spreading its germs. Look how stupid it looks as well. Viruses aren't even meant to ride bikes. <clears throat> but what it doesn't know is that the law is never far behind. Wow, you're so fast. I know, but the law is faster. Covid-19, it will kill you. I think it's funny that the first person to get Covid probably doesn't even know it was them. Well, I think about it all the time, John. Sad reality is, they're probably dead. Well, I mean, they're probably well, not. But hold it, John. What is he doing wrong? He's not wearing a mask on campus. 
Exactly. And what are campus rules? Uh, always wear a mask on campus. But shouldn't we be wearing masks? Oh, shut up, John. Go deal with the situation before the virus kills him. Hi, uh, excuse me. Yeah? Um, would you mind putting on a mask, please? Uh, uh, why? Uh, well, it's just because when you're on campus, you've got to wear a mask. Oh, right, okay. Um, I'm outside, but... Yeah, I know. Uh, it's just sort of the, the campus rules, I guess. Right, well, uh, I was going home anyway, so... Okay, okay. Thank, uh, you. thank you. Excellent technique, John. You're showing good promise. I don't know, I feel bad. I mean, he was outside and... Look, 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 the rules are clear, John. If you've got your mask on on campus, then the virus cannot and it will not touch you. The second you take it off, that virus will wipe you out faster than Prince Andrew can wipe his hard drive. Now, a key part of our jobs and ultimately saving the lives of these students is surveillance. Tell them, John. Uh, yeah. Um, so we've got these walkie-talkies and we leave them around campus and then we can hear if anyone's talking about coronavirus or if they say they've got coronavirus, then we can really monitor them with accuracy. Exactly that. Government's track and trace app, horseshit. This is 100% accuracy. The Chinese are doing it right. Listen to everything, John. Right, you go over there, we'll test out your code name. El Gato, come in. El Gato, come in. John, that's you, you're El Gato. I thought I was Spanish cat. Where's your walkie-talkie, John? Uh, I must have left it on campus. I'm really sorry. You're a bloody genius. We've got a code delta. A what? We aren't actually meant to start surveillance on campus until next week. But John has shown some promising signs of initiative and left his walkie-talkie out anyway. I was going to bend him over and give him the four nine lashes for his incompetence. But actually, he's managed to find the first case of COVID-19 on this campus. Yeah, so I, I got the coronavirus test back and I'm... Uh positive yeah yeah I'm, I'm just calling because you should probably test yourself too you're a bloody genius John we've caught him uh, I mean do we really know that's what they're saying I mean it could be saying anything right maybe it just sounds like that because that's what we're listening for no John I'm certain do we do we know who it is I mean it, it could be anyone right you know what saying that I do actually recognize the voice in there but, again, it, it could be anyone. Not me, of course, because uh, I was the one who put it there in the recon point. Yeah, good point, actually. But they're calling someone, so that means the virus is starting to spread. Get your stuff, John! Let's go! I didn't leave my walkie-talkie out in the field. I kept it at home. As for the person on the recording, well, that's, uh, that's me. I have coronavirus. So as we can see, with increased surveillance, we have an increased data pool. John, phone. So if our application for more spy equipment and more volunteers comes through, John, phone, third time if it wasn't for this useless government track and trace app i put this phone in the fucking shred seven more days of isolation any more symptoms call this number nhs helpline don't move a muscle no john sit down and think of England. So it turns out my only student, John, was the sole positive case of coronavirus in the university. Upon further inspection, we found a conservative membership card in his wallet, and that itself was sufficient grounds for arrest. It's a thankless job, really. You only really remember for the bad ones. But COVID-19 doesn't fight itself, so I'll let you guys go. <coughs>